welcome 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 gemini's oh my god gemini's let's see what's happening oh welcome this is the month happy birthday my babies happy birthday gemini's i can't sing so i love you guys let's see what's coming up gemini's in the first week gemini's debt end is coming in if some of you gemini's are dealing with a pisces cancer um debt is coming up okay they're going to be recognizing the lies and the disturbingness of this woman this woman use zwatomachi go back and look at the aquarian readings because it's, a, it's as if an aquarian is helping some of you gemini's to get out of some sort of a situation so it's going to be emotional it's going to be an ending that is coming in in the first week of april and that is very good if it um is your birthday week no your birthday week is in the end of may all right i see Ooh you are having um the energy of uh, um mm, the empress the energy of the empress transition with your materialistic stability this is good um the energy of the empress is coming in the second week and this is going to be good you're dealing with a wife your mother and a wife in uh, the second week your grandmother um, your mother-in-law um this is about materialistic money financial stability transition is coming up and this is going to be good okay oh a lot of transition is coming up i love that energy then we have the energy of the fool the energy of the fool is here and you start a lot of you gemini's are going to be getting in the third week because a lot of you gemini's are going to be recognizing what was happening and transpiring and how you were actually um how people stole from you gemini's and how people got away from using you and especially you gemini women i see that you are going to be recognizing that if you had problems um with providing for your kids and you start is coming up in the second week a resolution i love your week gemini so i do love you guys so much the last week you're going to be having some sort of an inner strength you're looking for inner strength to deal with some sort of an issue a lot of you are dealing with a whole lot of problems uh, and uh, this is the energy of uh, you um really dealing with uh, some um issues and problems uh, where um you are trying to figure out uh, how to balance this out this is like a tower moment that is going to be coming up uh, um, for a whole lot of you okay and the star moment is as if the star moment have to come up because when we have the energy of strength it's about endurance endurance and a lot of you um it is endurance and and it has to do with um issues and problems that you're enduring and have to be dealing with okay the energy of the fool is the energy of Urania. so the energy of the empress is the energy of um, materialistic stability the energy of the empress is always the energy of the world ladies and gentlemen and this is good my telephone is um going off um it is the energy of the world and whenever the empress comes up it is about creativity and it's about love it's about love so um that was what i said about the female energy um that is happening and transpiring it has to do with the the energy of the female energy and it's about venus the planet of love now debt is about transition in the first week and it's about something that really needs to come to an end okay and when we look at the energy of debt um we are looking at the undesirable situation that was transpiring in your world that needs to come to an end okay and when we look at the energy of debt we are looking at transition that is going to be coming up for a, a, a cancer and a scorpion. So whoever a cancer and a scorpion is, I did say to you, a transition is coming up for a cancer and a scorpion on a scorpion in your world. Okay. All right. Let's go in your reading and see what's coming out in the first week. The ace of disc money is going to be returning to a lot of you Gemini's. Some sort of a transition is going to be coming up where money is going to be returning. A lot of you Geminis are going to be finding out that money is going to be returning. And I see I you hope for some sort of a completion. Um, You could be having some sort of an issue with a bank and an institution where you could be overcharged. However, this is coming up in transparent. But I see this bank and financial institution is going to be making sure 
that the money is returned to you then we see the energy of a pleasure in the second week a lot of you um you know could be having in a new relationship you mothers uh who have been single could have some sort of a new relationship i say a whole lot of love love this is going to be a powerful week of love um, especially for you ladies, so a whole lot of pleasure and a whole lot of love. A new start to some sort of a relationship. Then we see, well, the energy of the Ten of Pentacles, um, a whole lot of wealth and a bank financial institution is going to be recognizing some sort of an unfair game and some sort of a fraud that was created. And is it you, Gemini's, are going to be showing it up or a bank of financial institution is going to be recognizing that a fraud was created and they're going to be trying um, to, like, um, you know, protect uh, a situation by, um, you know, uh, you know, trying to pay you off. OK, then um, ninth guilt. This is the nine of swords, a whole lot of worries and guilt. Um, an Aquarius is going to be recognizing what has been happening, transpiring. A whole lot of uh, guilt is going to be coming up in uh, the um, in the the, um, the third week. Okay, in the third week, a whole lot of guilt is going to be coming up. The energy of the Nine of Swords, but this is going to be ending. But a lot of you mothers could be feeling very guilty. Um, Gemini's, you're going to be victorious and successful in the third week. The third week is an air week. It's your week. You're going to be victorious and successful. So whatever you're doing, do it in the third week. The energy of the fool, you will be victorious and successful. You're going to be victorious and successful. The last week, the energy of strength, trying to find inner strength to deal with a, a situation. And you are going to be finding that inner strength because you're standing your ground. Um, this energy of disappointment is in the reverse. So some of you are going to be finding your inner guides and inner potential um, in order to find some sort of an inner strength to deal with a Leo and a Sagittarian for some of you. And I see that they're going to be feeling guilty over something that they have done. Here you go. Here you go, ladies and gentlemen. Gemini, you are leaving the, this month of May very, very, very happy by using the sword of truth, taking down um, a Leo that was creating a whole lot of issues, standing your ground, speaking your truth, and really ending some sort of an unconventional situation where a Leo um, that was creating a whole lot of problems, a whole lot of issue for you. You, Geminis, are going to be standing your ground and said to hell here and no more. Here and no more, okay? So it can be anyone. For some of you, it's going to be a Leo. Some of you guys are going to be a Sagittarian. But for most of you, it's like, I am not taking this anymore. No more, no more. And you're ending the month on a positive note. Um, The haste of uh, uh, swords upright where you're taking down a situation and I see some good news is going to be coming in. Absolutely good news is going to be coming in. So congratulations for that. So I see transition is going to be coming up. A lot of you, a whole lot of pleasure. Um, This is the energy of the Six of Cups. Um, a whole lot of pleasure, a whole lot of happiness with friends. You're going to be regaining connection with friends that you have lost and um, friends that you were cut off from because of some sort of an unconventional play that was created and the truth is now going to be revealed so transition is here and the transition is going to be coming up with your money and financial stability and uh, the end of the week you are going to be receiving some sort of a good news so here we go um, this is transition. It's uh, about changes with your um, Ace of Pentacles, uh, and uh, it, it has to do with a bank financial institution. They're going to be now looking at a situation and recognizing what was going on and how people were trying to um, create some sort of our problems and issues in order for some of you not to get some money. And I see that they're going to be recognizing what people were doing that and transition and you're going to be victorious and successful over friends that have tried to create some sort of a problem some sort of a issues for you a lot of you are going to be standing your ground against a um 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 
the friends that have created a whole lot of mess for you and you're going to be victoriously successfully overcoming this and this is going to be good in the first week so the first week you are going to be dealing with friends but whatever these friends and these people are you're going to be victoriously successfully overcoming this the energy of the empress in the second week and with the energy of the empress in the second week um, it's about money returning to you. A lot of you, a whole lot of money is going to be returning to you, okay? Because um, you recognize that there was some sort of unfair um, conventional things that was happening and transpiring. Um, you know, people are very sick and cruel. Um, and a lot of you uh, Geminis are going to be understanding the sickness and cruelness of people that just want to rip off other people. Um, and you're going to be recognizing how um, dishonorable these people are and how this, these people have created a whole lot of problems um, and have ripped you off. You're going to be recognizing that someone who you are married to or you are in some sort of a relationship has ripped rip some of you off seriously seriously rip some of you off it's a sick um situation that has transpired but it's someone who you were in a relationship with and i see um you recognize that and you're going to be standing your ground because you recognize what this person have done and you're going to be standing your grounds and said return the money return the money or else i'm going and you're going to be reporting this person for what they have done. So you stood your ground um, against a, a group of people that tried to create some sort of a problem. Now, you ladies, you're going to be seeing some sort of a cruelty that has transpired um, to you, to your uh, child, to your partner, where they stole a lot of money or a bank financial institution is going to be recognizing that some people tried to steal a whole lot of money and was creating a whole lot of problems in order to steal a whole lot of money and i see they're going to be coming down on these people there is no question about it they're definitely going to be coming down on these people um because they recognize and a lot of you gemini's are going to be recognizing that a friend of yours they tried to steal a whole lot of money from a friend of yours and you are going to be ending the situation and i see a bank could be helping you gemini to regain all of what someone had stolen from you okay in the third week the second week and third week is going to be your best i see a lot of air sign people the third week you have the energy of uh, the fool going on a new journey and uh, a lot of you um gemini's are going to be meeting um someone new uh open up for this relationship because this person you could be ending up marrying and going to live with, okay? Some of you Geminis, I see a bank financial institution is going to be wanting to work together with you to resolve some sort of an issue where a friend um, or your partner self have stolen a lot of money and this bank and institution is going to be helping you to resolve it and you start is going to be coming in. You're going to be overcoming what your friends had tried to do against you okay it's a really sick situation because uh, it's all about money and you know there are people who don't worth um anything but wants to um uh, take money for themselves okay i see you gemini's are not going to be disappointed you're starting over and you're not going to be disappointed i see some of you gemini just recognize that the person you were in a relationship or a marriage with was very cruel Whoever this person is that you were in a relationship or a marriage with was very, very cruel. It was a sick person um, and, and very cruel. And I see you're not disappointed that they are not going to get a new start. And you're not disappointed about walking away from them because you recognize that this person was blatantly sick and cruel. So Aridas, Geminis, what is coming out is that you're going to be getting a new start and you start overcoming the cruelty that was a, a transpire with you. Your whole partner has stolen, lie and stolen from you. And you're going to be recognizing this for some of you. Some of you are going to be recognizing some sick game that was played by your friends or people 
um, around you and you're going to be standing your grounds basically and really um, showing people that hey um, you know I don't want to deal with your um, situation you're trying to find um, strength in the last week um, because you recognize how sick and cruel and how people wanted to get away with a lot of money that they never worked to get but wanted to create some sort of a criminal offense in order to get money and a lot of you recognize that your partner needs um, help mental health that your partner have some sort of a mental health issue because they are criminals okay and that your partner was connected with some sort of a criminal organization so here you are in the last week you are not disappointed you are finding strength to move on letting go of these horrible people and these situation people that just want to sit and and don't create anything for themselves but wants to um you know um facilitate from of someone else's back and i see you use the sword of a true gemini and stood your ground and said now it's over now it is over so you go gemini's i um you know this is your the last week um is your birthday so so this is good the two last week is your birthday and you're going to be overcoming a really criminal deal um that your partner has put you through your partner is very disturbing i'm sorry not for all of you for some of you you have a very disturbing person this person is mentally in balance uh, a very disturbing person and you know you gemini's you can't blame yourself because uh, um the devil always come as if it's a fox and once a cat look like a fox it's just a, a fox and you know sometimes you gemini's are not recognizing um who these people are you are um you get caught up in a situation where you never see um this real fox okay this the, whoever your partner is was not a really honest person so i see you are going to be overcoming the cruelty of your friends and what your friends have done you're definitely going to be overcoming it and you're not going to be having um no sort of a um a, um you know like oh I, I I wish that didn't happen. No, you have no disappointment. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. I need to take the um uh, uh yeah. And um you're not going to be oh, you're not going to be um disappointed. You're going to be happy um that they have caught these people. Um, you know, really caught these people as to what these people have done. It is a sad situation, um, but it's a situation where you're going to be recognizing that your own your own um someone who you have um some sort of a relationship with um have really um they and their friends have really um you know took a lot from you this person is seriously sick this person have only connected with some of you gemini's for materialistic stability and it was connected with a criminal corporation institution that you were yourself was not even aware of who this person is and what this person was doing and now it is all coming out so you know protection is going to be here for you gemini's and it's a sad situation um who your friends are and you know it's better you don't have friends in, instead of you end up um, with these criminal offensive and these sort of a people in your world because it just changes who you are as a person all right let's go and see what is coming up so in the first week going in the second week i see that you're going to be finding out something about your wife okay and the end is coming in for your wife and this is what i'm saying if your wife is a scorpion or a cancer um, I see a lot of you are going to be ending some sort of a marriage with this person. Yes. Uh, yes. Now, you women are going to be standing, you Gemini women are going to be standing your ground in order to get back some money. And I see that if you're married to a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion woman, this woman is going to be um, wanting a whole lot of money from you. And I say no, no to her. You never marry and having um, wealth she never had any wealth this woman comes in with nothing on her ass let her leave with nothing on her ass and this is it and this is why i advise a lot of people do not get married and you know you that is listening you knew you didn't have to get married you could have had kids 
um, sign a piece of paper that you, you know, but you didn't have to get married. And whoever this woman is, she never had jack shit. The woman is a liar. The woman is connected to a criminal organization and is a liar. And she never had jack shit. Now she comes in and she wants to take you down for everything. And this is it. Ladies and gentlemen, get wake up. You do not have to marry. You do not have to marry because the man is, the, the, the child is going to get the man's name in any way. You do not have to marry. And if you didn't marry, this little um, what ass woman that has nothing, bush rat, would not have taken all of your money. And yeah, I'm, you know, this is a sad situation, ladies and gentlemen. If you know how many women don't have jack shit and see people going to be connecting with people, and going to be wanting to take them down for a whole lot of money. And some of you, they're going to be recognizing that your wife, uh, together with other people, have stolen a lot of money. Um, They are going to be recognizing that. I see a lot of you women are going to be standing your ground in order to um, um reinstate that a whole lot of money returned to you that was stolen. And a lot of you women are going to be standing your ground against a little criminal woman and her kids uh, and what she has done. Wow. I see in the second week going in the third week, there is going to be some sort of an investigation. Um, there could be for some of uh, you, there are going to be investigating and recognizing how your wife and your wife family and your wife friends have stolen a lot of money from a lot of people, from your family, um, from you, your family, your friends. Uh, and they're going to be recognizing the unsavorable game of this criminal organization. And they're going to bring it to an end and release you. And I see some of you, they're going to be dissolving the marriage. It's as if people in power is going to be saying this was no marriage. Um, this person had married to this person only to gain financial stability and to gain possession in a country. No, we are dissolving the marriage. So a lot of you Gemini men, because of the cruelty that was done to a lot of you Gemini men, um and women i see um that they're going to be dissolving the marriage you women money is going to be coming back and they're going to be recognizing how you were treatedly unfair especially women with children a whole lot of cruelty had transpired against you they now see la amour that is it you men are going to be um recognizing and again this is coming up for men uh, men, your wife, someone you're in a relationship with, um, and it's coming up as a cancer or a scorpion, have ripped you off a whole lot of money, and you're going to be victoriously overcoming this person. They're going to be recognizing it's as if it's not the first time this person have done it. They recognize that this per person is connected to a whole lot of criminal people in criminal organization, institution, and this is a group of people that are friends that they... um rip people other people off in order to get financial gain for themselves if this is how they live their life normal people live their life by getting up and working and doing something these people are criminals so i see you stood your grounds gemini gemini's you are stood in your ground i see a lot of work um a lot of business a lot of meetings um in the third week going in the fourth week a lot of meetings a lot of business association um, a lot of you um, have work and private problems with your wife and your your wife's family. They're investigating a lot of you. They're investigating your wife's and your wife's family. Women, they are investigating your husband and your husband's family. A lot of you, it's going to be a busy week. They're going to be investigating and recognizing the cruelty of a group of friends and what they have done to you, Gemini. Yay, 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 Gemini. Yay, yay, yay. Um, they can't keep you down, Gemini's. Uh, Gemini's, they can't keep you down. It's your it's your week. The second week going in the fourth week is your week, Gemini's. And look at that. They can't keep you down. This is huge success. This is you, Gemini, using your sort of truth to bring down a really horrible situation. Um, that friends has to do. You're going to be victorious and successful. And I see you, Gemini's, walking away. Walking away and looking for better shores. Walking away and letting a situation just fall um, from uh, the wayside. Just using your sword and truth to let people know this is where you go and this is how far you go with me. So success is here from you, Gemini. Um, good news, victory, and success. You're going to be regaining. You're going to be successfully overcoming um, your wife, your girlfriend, their partners, and their 
um relationship and what they were doing so here it is a lot of you at work or at home um a lot of you who are in a relationship with a pisces cancer or scorpion person there this person their family is on the investigation um okay so if you are married to a pisces cancer or scorpion person they and their family or on the investigation because they recognize what this woman has done. A lot of you business women are going to be very busy. I see um, friends, network friends are going to be collaborating together. And a lot of you business men, uh, business women are going to be um, uh, working together in collaboration. I see a lot of you business women and other mothers are collaborating together. You are going to be re receiving some sort of a news. And you're going to, whatever this news is, um, uh, a lot of you that had some sort of a business, you're going to be receiving some sort of a positive news that you're victoriously successful over a really horrible play that a group of people, a group of friends tried to do. The cruelty of a group of friends. And they, they're now looking at the situation and investigating the situation and seeing how a group of friends have really tried to create some sort of a problem and issue and, 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 and um, a news, a, a letter is going to be coming in. This is going to be good news in the third week. The third week, as you begin your birthday, zodiac period, um, this news is going to be coming in and it's going to be very, very positive. So news is coming in from a corporation institution, letting you know something, um, news about work, some sort of a promotion could be coming up at work. And this is going to be, um, really, really good. Okay. And I see, um, you are going to be finding the inner strength. They're going to be recognizing that a, uh, a Sagittarian and a Leo tried to steal a lot of money. They're going to be coming down on this person. I see you have no regret. I see you really recognize the lies and deceptiveness. You're going to be very successful because a group of people are going to be recognizing the lies and disturbingness of uh, um, your wife that is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person and uh, an Aries Leo or, or, and Sagittarian that have tried to create uh, some sort of a problems and issue. Um, some This is going to be happening to some of you at the workplace that these people try to make you look bad or to create some sort of a problems for you at the workplace. So these are family members of your wife. A lot of you, you um, mothers with kids, you're going to be getting some sort of a good news. So you mothers with kids um, or, or uh, wives, mothers, wives, some sort of a good news could be coming in for you guys. Okay. So that is absolutely, absolutely wonderful. I love you. Gemini's. Okay. Let's see what is coming out. Grief. A lot of you Gemini's, especially men, you're going to be griefing over a really disturbing situation of your wife and her family or your girlfriend and her friends. So a lot of you Gemini men are going to be in grief. Yeah. Gemini women and men are going to be in grief and you're going to be letting yourself out of some sort of a cub that someone has placed you in. Um, a very disturbing person that some of you was in a relationship in. You are grieving and you're going to be letting yourself, you're going to be releasing yourself from this horrible, horrible play of this person. So grief is going to be coming up in the first week. Um, grief in this month. And um, with this grief, you're going to be uh, recognizing it's time to let go of a, a situation, a relationship, a problem. It's time to just let go and let God. Let go and let God, okay? Let go and let God. Whatever is happening and transpiring this month is a month of letting go grief. And with this grief, you're going to learn to let go of the situation. Then we see growth, growth. And growth is with your financial uh, stability, growth with your business. And I see that you are going to be taking your child. So it is a situation where a lot of you women with kids are going to be protecting your kids from some dishonorable situation that was going on. And a lot of you men are going to be divorcing your wife and take your kid. I don't know what was wrong with some of you men. You got to think with your head and listen to your instinct. When you meet a woman, you know from the beginning that this woman was trouble. The stories didn't play out. The stories, lies. 
and you are going to take your kid and you really, really don't care. It is your kid. The kid carries the name. You're going to be taking your kid. A lot of you women are going to be protecting your kids. Okay. Then, um, yes, um, perception. Wow. Perception. Gemini's, you are now going to be recognizing um, what life is all about, what life is all about, what people are all about. People are about money, financial status, and that's all of it. You're going to be recognizing that people only connect with some of you because of your financial status, which is very bad. And you're going to be recognizing um, that people are very, very deceptive, very deceptive. And I told you guys, I love, I love people. I love humanity. But there is some people, Jesus, have mercy, Lord. I am telling you, there are some people and the greed and the hate. And this is how you know hurtlings. Hurtlings are people who are very greedy and very hateful and very jealous. And this is what you Geminis are going to be recognizing Oh my God, when is this going to stop? And I see a lot of you ask, when is this going to stop? This is what you're dealing. This is what you Gemini's is actually waking up out of your bubble and is recognizing the evil of people. And uh, it is going to be ending soon because a lot of you are going to be freeing yourself from it. And you cannot sit in a situation and hope that someone comes and free you. You got to free yourself from this situation. Wow, what a powerful, powerful month. It is uh, the two last week is your birthday um, month. It is very powerful. A lot of you women are going to be protecting your child from the evil. And I see a lot of you men or um who have recognized that your wife is uh, really sick and um what your wife have done. You are going to be taking your child and they are going to be um the judge, they are going to be saying, yes, he takes the child. She has no custody, no connection. But I tell you, she can't come off to you because, uh, um, you know, you are the protector of her child. Um, I see that this woman manipulates some of you, Gemini, in order to use this child. Um, and it can be, you know, you Gemini mothers and um, uh, men and women, you were manipulated by your, your partner in order to have a child. And I see you're going to be releasing yourself, okay? And it is a sick situation, but people must recognize that having a child for someone doesn't say that you control the child. And I'm saying to people out there, you do not have to get married. There is no must under the face of the universe to get married. Americans stop getting married. This is how people what you have worked hard for, anyone, and um, there is no must. You do not have to get married. And some of you were pushed in a marriage in order for people to have financial stability. And I'm telling you, ladies and gentlemen, wake up. You do not need to be married to anyone, okay? Um, you can go through life and having a relationship and living together. You do not have to be married, Okay. I'll see a lot of you business women are going to be doing good. A lot of women are going to be standing, taking back their powers. I see a lot of custody battles with women. Men, some of you men are going to be winning the custody battle. If you um, have any custody battle that you were doing with any Aries Lee or Sagittarian, you're going to be winning. Any legal issues with Aries Lee or Sagittarian, um, whether these were your kid's parents or your partner, you are going to be winning. Um, a lot of you are going to be using the sword of truth to take down the devil. Whoever the devil is, a lot of you are going to be recognizing that you have been living with the, the devil and you have been sharing your bed and your life with this energy of the devil. You're using the sword of truth to cut yourself away and say, hell no, it's not happening. It's not happening. Not in my watch. So I do love you guys. Please like share these videos. And I see some sort of a good news is going to be coming in for you guys. And it's about good news about growth, growth that is going to be happening for a lot of you. I do love you guys. Namaste until next time.